Let's take a look at what's powering this 300SL Gold Wing Coupe. To do so, we've already released the hood from the inside lever. We'll lift up on the hood. There's a secondary release in here that will release. Lift up on the hood, and there's a latch down here that we have to pull up till it latches to lock the hood up. This amazing new sports car was not only elegant and designed, but was quite innovative. It was the world's first four-stroke production passenger car to be equipped with output, energy-enhancing direct fuel injection. The 182.8 cubic inch overhead cam straight six was rated at 215 brake horsepower and would propel this car to speeds upwards of 160 miles per hour, therefore making it the fastest production car of its day. The only transmission available was a four-speed manual equipped with powerful drum brakes, fit at each corner, and a fully independent front suspension. Due to the massive size of these engines, and also due to the tubular framing in this car, these engines were actually tilted at about 45 degree angle so that they would fit in underneath the hood and into the tubular framing. To start the Mercedes, we'll first turn the key on. We will pull the fuel pump switch on. You'll hear it humming. We will choke the car. We'll notice that the white light comes on and the choke's on, and we'll turn the key. Once it's started, you can release the choke. We notice the red light went off, so we know that it's idling correctly. We can eventually turn off the fuel pump, and we're ready to drive.